Hey guys, welcome back. I'm sorry, I'm filming early in the morning. It's getting a bit dark. I'm not even sure how the quality is going to show up on video, but I'm really sorry, guys. I have to give it a try. Hopefully, it's going to look good. I'll put on these lights here. I'm not sure if it's going to be disturbing you or anything like that. I'm trying to get it to connect into my phone, but every single time it just re asked me to reconnect and set up the Wi Fi. It is literally annoying. Oh yeah guys, so welcome back, it's your boy Lucky and today I'm going to talk about my fuel, my cost of the A4, so why I use I mean, a fuel up and stuff like that. So, because I go out on location to do my photo work and stuff like that, I do do loads of miles and I have to fuel up a lot, but for general use, like in town, you go to uni just with the family and kids about that, it is a good job. It's supposed to do 50 miles, 55 miles to the gallons. I think I'm doing around the 45, sometimes less. Depend how well I drive. Let's get it. Heating one is getting really foggy. But yeah, otherwise, depending on fuel, it really depends on your driving. If you drive really good, yeah, the fuel is going to last you longer. But if you're aggressive and just going pew pew pew, yes, the fuel is going to go quickly for me. If I want to last a fuel, yes I can, I'll drive slowly, carefully, but otherwise I'll just go boom, to speed up and the fuel will go quicker, which is normal guys. But other costs, I really don't have anything, because I'm on PCP with Audi, my service and everything was done with Audi, so I still got like so many miles to do my service, let me check that really while I'm driving, I shouldn't be doing this when I'm driving, but let's check service I still have another 7,800 miles for my next oil change and my full service at 8,000 miles so I got a long long time if not it's 278 days for my next thing and I had this car for nearly a year I had no problems I think twice I had issued one was because during the snow time I took the car out and I was going crazy and I was losing loads of air on the tires took it down to Audi they said that's fine don't worry we'll check your tires for the mop and that was it they didn't charge me anything or nothing like that very nice and once I had a needle in one of the tires took it to Audi they changed it for me they charged me 25 pounds for that very cheap Otherwise, no other cost has like affected me into now MOT Rotex, nothing. And when my car is due for MOT, I just go back to Audi, give it to them, they will do it. And if there's any problems, I think I only have to pay 25 or 75, I can't remember. And whatever the cost of the MOT, all the way up to 750 pounds, they're gonna cover it. So that is extremely good. That, the good thing of being on the PCP is that they will look after you, just going for checkups, anything like that. If you have anything, I can always call them up. This is wrong. They'll be like, bring it over. We'll have a look at it. This doesn't charge you anything. That would be very nice. You get your coffee, your snacks, and everything while they look after you. It's really nice, guys. Yes, I'm paying the monthly fee, but it's everything included. We have to look at that. So my stress-free, the MOT and everything is the best part all this is covered so I'm really glad about that otherwise I really don't have any problems this one cost wise just fuel I just fuel up and go the tires are pretty good they're brand new anyway so they're gonna last me long times I'm covered from Audi for service for the next two full services so that's still another maybe one another year and a half left I got that before that even you by the time I've done two full service so by that time I'll probably change my car get something much bigger or something nicer because I'm not going to keep this forever I had this for a year maybe another two years guys depends I'm not like that rich to change car every single time but I am planning on getting another small car because I'm using this for business and I'm doing a lot of miles as you guys already know of on nearly 11,000 miles so I'm on 10,960 miles in less than a year that is insanely crazy so I need to like slow down on that but well 
I spoke with like one of my accountants who well, was my photo work. He said I could put this car on a business plan and that will save me money. And if I do that, I can get another car if I want and do stuff for my personal use, which is something I did consider. But then I did look, look online, and a lot of people do that. The reason why you guys get two car is to save on the mileage and fuel is going to be the same. Insurance could be a bit higher, but it's more about the value of the car. Because this one, I think now is down to like 28,000 pounds, and I got this for 43 guys, so that's a lot has gone down in just those 11,000 miles. And if we keep going, it's just gonna keep going down. And I'm not gonna take the risk, that's my main concern. It's about the business, I'll worry about that later because I only started my photography, I'm just moving up now slowly, getting that good. And yes, I can put this in, but I want to take some time and think about that. But for now, I'm Probably want to add a small secondary car, like a maybe something small, like a one or mini, or something like that. Probably get like a BMW M2 or a TT. I'm not 100% sure. I need to look into it, see what the costs are coming. It's about getting a new one, used one, or a car old, and something I can have fun with because this is big. I only got this because of my work. Suggestions of getting a small car. I don't know. I really want to get back my Audi A3. I did look it online. I couldn't find it anywhere. So someone is currently using it. It might go back on sale soon, or I don't know, get a newer version of the A3. I probably won't get a new car. Probably go for like a used car, maybe two, three years old. Sorry about that, guys. But yeah, I need to look into that. I know it's a lot of money, I have saved up some money for that anyway because it was something I did plan on before but then I was like, if I get two car, family, friends can be like, oh you're so rich, you got two car, blah 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 and yeah that's going to be a headache even if I go home and tell my dad like, I'm going to buy a second car and they would be like, why are you doing that, buy a house and yeah I'm a student, I'm not even sure if I can get a house on my name or even if the banks will give me a mortgage or anything like that Spotting guys, I'm really sorry I haven't been doing that. It's another Mercedes C63 that looks nice. Let's hope it comes in free. Is it gonna come behind me? Nope, it is coming, it's coming slowly, guys. But yeah, I need to do that even today. You knew there was a AMG G Class G Wagon. I'm not sure I didn't look at it, but I think it's a German Reg. Yeah, as I told you guys, my university gets so many nice cars when they come.
stuck, come home, sleep, and get nothing chance. I might take the camera with me when I'm using his car, I don't know. Probably filming that, but then there's gonna be my uncle's gonna be there, and then it's gonna be all awkward, and I'm still shy. <laughs> Not even my, my family knows that I'm doing this vlogging online. So, yeah, let's see how that goes, guys. But yeah, we'll just see how everything goes and stuff like that. Let's go with the speed bumps. But yeah, guys, that's what I'm planning. Probably gonna get a smaller car. That was the main reason. With these vlogs and everything, I wanna like do this. I always wanted to. And yeah. Oh yeah, I've ordered some new stuff for my car as well. I've got some new badges for the front and the back. I've got some, got some glass black ones. I was thinking of um, plastic dip them but I know when I did it to my A3 last time it took me ages and it never turned out really good. That's why I just bought them again. But yeah, let's see how that goes. I want to de-chrome the window trims and everything like that but I still haven't decided if I want to do it myself and do it professionally. I've, I've seen the trims. I can get them from Amazon and eBay just like strips. Easy. I did try and look for the door handle, they do look nice and it is a great thing. But yeah, I need to like double check that and everything before I go on with that. But yeah, we'll see about that. I do want to get stuff into this car and get some filming stuff for you guys. I've even decided to wash my car from now on so I can even do some more videos. So I bought some, what's it called, jet pressure washer. Jet wash pressure, I'm not really sure. I bought a few of those things that should come very really soon. And when they get there, I'll start spending more time washing my cars and putting videos up with that as well. What I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna see if I can pull my car up somewhere. Look, that's a nice car there. So, what? Audi. I think that's A6. He's parked up there doing something. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna park here because I'm not close to my house. What I wanna do is show you guys the interior lighting now. So, I'm gonna show you what was I talking about? I got really confused, guys. Yeah, so I'm gonna start um, washing my car by myself. I bought some stuff, it's gonna come soon, and I will do some nice stuff. And hopefully get that on but for now I'm going to show you the light pack inside I've got my car because it's dark now and it will look proper nice no, it's getting too dark guys I'm joking let me show you I like just give you a quick snip of that guys give me two seconds so as you can see last these are the lights I have inside goes around here and here stuff like that the boot and the door it's really nice the lights here as you can see it looks nice I'm going to do a full video on the light packs in the dark because I've got these lights and these. So I'm going to do a full video on that. But yeah, I just hope this looks good on camera, guys. But if it's not, I'm going to upload it anyway so you guys can just see it. But I hope it looks nice. Stuff like that. But yeah. Let's see what happens guys, so I'm going to head home now, I've got another like 5 minutes drive, but hopefully I should have been here home soon, I'm extremely tired, it's a long day, and tomorrow back to work, so I do want to go home and just relax, but I hope the video looks good guys, and thank you for watching, make sure you subscribe, I've got my Instagram page below, I'm going to be doing, like taking pictures of my car and blowing that, so if you want to follow me there, please do follow me, and if you want to send me share some pictures of your cars, Audis and smarts I can do to my car, please do share that guys. But yeah guys, thank you for watching, make sure you subscribe, leave a like and I will see you on the next one guys.